Let's get straight into this tutorial. So this is the new offline traffic tool for Asset Corsa. You need the latest custom shaders patch. I have the Patreon version, but the free version will work too. Just make sure you've got the latest untested. The recommended won't work. First go to your Asset Corsa folder, then extension, then Lua, then tools, and finally CSP traffic tool. Now using the data file, which I've supplied a link for in the description, Open it up, you will need a tool such as WinRAR to do this. Then drag the folder into the CSP traffic tool. Now go into the map folder that you want to add traffic to. Now open the data folder and open the surfaces file using Notepad. Scroll to the bottom. I've already done this, so I'm just going to delete it and redo it, just for this video. Now you need to input the script and physics. Again, I've left a link in the description for that. Just open that up in Notepad, then copy it and paste it into here. Now where it says surface underscore zero, we need to change the zero, since we already have a surface underscore zero at the top. So scroll back to the bottom, look for the last surface, and as you can see, the last one is surface underscore 13, so the next one will be 14. So we're going to change the zero to 14, then save it. Now we need to enable point and click objects inspector. Just make sure this is ticked. If it's not, then just check it. Now for the fun part, load in game in practice mode. Once in game, press F7 to enter free cam. Next, go to anywhere on the map where you want to start your traffic lanes. Now go to Apps, select Object Inspector, then select Tools, then Traffic Planner. Here you can change the speed of the traffic and just the amount of cars that you want to spawn. Next we're going to go to Lanes. If you read the bottom it tells you how to do this. Hold Ctrl and click the left mouse to start. Now drag the mouse to start the lane. When you're happy, just left click it again and this will start a new section. Once you've finished your first lane, untick lane 1 so you can start a new lane. Then just repeat the same process. Now we want to extend our lanes. To do this, tick the lane that you want to extend and repeat the same process.
Now we're going to add an intersection. To do this, select intersections. Again, just like the lanes, this also tells you how to do it. But instead of holding control, this time we hold shift. Once that's done, you can add traffic lights. Select Edit Connections, then Traffic Light, and select Basic. Just to speed things up, what I'm going to do is just add some random lanes just to show you what this looks like. But obviously, when you're doing this properly, it's going to take you some time. Well that's the end of the tutorial, I hope this was helpful, thanks for watching.